first of all, ew. Second of all, ew. I had gotten told so many times over and over again in multiple videos i feel like maybe once a video maybe maybe once every two videos i get told that i look like maddie i look like alexa demi um who plays maddie from euphoria that's who i get told i look like i don't see it at all i don't think we look anything alike she looks far better than what i could ever look i love her i love alexa i love maddie's style on euphoria of course everybody does but we look nothing alike but since I get told that I look like her, I was like, might as well transform into her. And earlier this year when I first watched Euphoria, I was like, yeah, I kind of want to do a transformation video. But I was like, should I say that for Halloween? Like a Halloween look? Because I bought her outfit from IMG, the iconic um, lucid top and lucid pants set thing the purple one from the carnival episode iconic episode one of my favorite episodes if not my all-time favorite episode this is me transforming into my look-alike but it's also like a halloween costume it's like a two for one type of situation i'm gonna start off with the hair so yeah i'm not doing like no tutorial or nothing i'm just showing you me doing my hair um it's just a slick back pony because that's what she had in the episode of the carnival a slick back pony and i thankfully at least know how to do that um i don't know how to do much with hair but i know how to do that my hair is mad greasy because sleeked hair like a sleeked ponytail looks best or works best with dirty ass greasy ass hair and i meant to wash my hair last night but it got really late so i was like might as well film this video today so that's why It's just a slick back pony and I did the little edges. I don't think she really did, hold on, let me look, let me check if she like did the swoops. I just normally do that when I put my hair in a slick ponytail and um, yeah. So she didn't really have her baby hairs out like that. They were kind of out. Like I'll put pictures up of her look from the carnival episode. Um, they were kind of there, but they weren't like swooped like this. It doesn't matter, you get the point. It's similar to slick back ponytail. You could even put hair extensions and I do have clip-ins, but it's not really practical for a ponytail, so it's not gonna really work. Now it's time for the makeup. The makeup for the most part is really simple other than the eye, the eyeliner that she had because it's rhinestones on the eyeliner. And me doing eyeliner is super annoying because I just struggle so hard doing eyeliner. So yeah, let me wash my hands up because I have like hair gel and shit on them. So I already moisturized my face. so I'm just going to go into primer. I'm going to use the NYX Angel Bell. This isn't really like a tutorial, like just do basic looking face makeup. She didn't have anything too crazy going on, like a little bit of blush. I'm going to bronze just because I personally like to bronze a little bit, but nothing crazy just basic face makeup i guess i don't even know what i'm gonna be for halloween like for real for real obviously like trick-or-treating and partying is not an option this year so i'm just gonna let the primer sit on my face for a little bit because i personally think that that does something it probably doesn't even do shit like i'm probably just i don't know but i feel like if i put face makeup like foundation or concealer right away i don't I don't know. I'm not a fucking makeup artist or a beauty guru, so I don't know. But I'm just gonna let it sit on my face for a little bit while I text back my boo. I'm so excited for AG6. I'm so excited for Ariana's new music, bro. Oh, okay, anyways. Every time I do my makeup on camera, I like blank out, like what the fuck is my next step? This isn't really a tutorial, so I don't really have to like, be like, I'm using this and this and that. Just know to do your regular, regular face makeup, you know? ASMR. I'm using Glossier. I can't help but say it. I'm using Glossier um, skin, perfecting skin tint or some shit like that. It's really bugging me that I don't have fucking nails. Like, I haven't been this long without nails. Like, I basically have gone the whole month of October so far, and I'm gonna continue going the whole month of October with no nails. And I haven't done that in forever, but that's because 
I go to a specific nail tech and I didn't make an appointment early enough for October. Like she, like when I tried to make an appointment and like the last week of September, she only had like the last two weeks of October left, like towards the end of October. And I'm like, that's not gonna work out for me because I want a good set for my birthday. I don't want like a grown out set and I don't wanna be caught in between sets. Like I want a fresh ass set for my birthday. So I made my appointment for my birthday set on the 12th of November because that's the day before my birthday, the 13th of November, which is on Friday the 13th this year, which means I'm gonna have the best birthday ever. Where was I going with that? I have no fucking clue, bro. <laughs> Where was I going with that? Basically just saying that I don't have no damn nails and I'm pressed because I'm not, I'm not me without my nails. I need my acrylics. I need them. Like this shit is not it, bro. It's, I'm for real pressed. This is such a first world problem, I get it. And it's like, oh boo hoo, you don't have nails. But bro, for real, it's like a part of me is missing, for real. Like my nails really are me. I am my nails. It's a part of me. Like I will spend money on my nails all day, any day, but like doing my eyebrows, I haven't got my eyebrows done in so long. Even if I wanted a lash lift, I'd rather use my money for my nails, for sure. So yeah. Now time for concealer. I really should have done my eyeliner first because I know I'm going to mess it up and I'm, I'm going to wipe. Fuck. I should have done the eyeliner first. Oh, I forgot setting powder. I gotta go get setting powder. So, like I said, her face makeup wasn't really like anything special. So, I'm just going to bronze a little bit, not too much. She wasn't really bronzy like that. I can't help but put bronzer on every time I do my makeup like I have to. Um, so, I'm just putting a little bit of bronzer. I don't even know what you call this color blush, but I feel like it's a little bit more natural to not super bright, like a bright peach, a bright coral, or bright as blue base pink. It's just something a little natural, but you just need a little bit of it. Did I even get any on? Sometimes I'm like, did I get anything on here? Yeah, she doesn't really look like she has any highlight. She just looks like she really has like a natural looking foundation face. Does that make, does that make any sense? I'm gonna set my face um, with the Rare Beauty setting spray or whatever this is. All in one, four in one, <laughs> four in one mist. This smells so good. Um, hmm. It smells like a spa, like skincare spa. Eyeliner on camera probably never comes out ever. I think I've only done it like one other time where I had to do eyeliner on camera and I was struggling. Bro, I'm gonna be struggling now. My hands be shaky. I'd be drinking coffee. <laughs> My hands are shaky. Okay. But this is like the important part. This is like, this is basically like the entire makeup look is the eyeliner with the rhinestones on it. So I gotta... Fuck. <laughs> Fuck, I need to like support myself somewhere. Shit. <sighs> okay, I made a line. I think so I can make less mistakes, I have to make the line first and make sure that they're even. So, or like symmetrical or like looking like sisters and not fucking acquaintances, peers, classroom peers. Fuck. I need juice. The eyeliner is on me, obviously, you can tell. Don't know if I did the best job, but I didn't do the worst job, at least from what I can tell. They look okay, they probably don't look the best, but I fucking tried, okay? And if I keep messing with it, it's gonna get worse. I already know that from experience. Like, Oh, I forgot to mention like before I was doing the eyeliner, but her eyeliner was purple to match the purple fit that she was wearing. I don't have purple eyeliner and I don't have an eyeshadow that's the same purple as the outfit. So I was just like, black it is. It's fine. Again, I'm not trying to be her stunt double here. I'm just trying to get a look similar. Like, nobody's gonna clock you on Halloween because you don't have the fucking purple eyeliner. You know what I mean? Like, anyways, 
this is where you need the little rhinestones. It's not Euphoria without rhinestones. It's not Maddie Perez without fucking rhinestones. So I'm gonna get my duo lash glue, which is what I'm gonna use to stick them on. I wish I had one of those like little thingies that picks up the rhinestones really easily. I don't have one of those, so I'm just gonna have to struggle a little bit. Shit, fuck you. <sighs> uh, uh. Ooh, wait. Oh my god, you guys. <laughs> I have one eye done. Uh, yeah, that's what one eye looks like. Hardest shit ever. God damn it. I keep dropping so many rhinestones. Fuck. I should have really sat this part, at least like the makeup part, filming down, or at least this rhinestone part filming down, but I did not feel like filming in my room because it's kind of dirty so i hope i go did i drop another fucking diamond not diamond they're not diamond bro what the hell okay so i definitely know that this eyeliner is a little thicker than this one because there's more like black space like there's more eyeliner left over than this one i don't know if i'm making any sense but this one is thicker slightly than this one so i'm kind of pressed this is the hardest part of this entire look is the eyeliner and the rhinestones so i have the fucking rhinestones on okay now i'm gonna do the last step which is the lips she had like a sparkly lip gloss looking something sparkly but i'm just gonna put on lip liner um one that kind of like sort of matches my natural lip just to make my lips look not ugly yeah it has some shimmer in it not as much as hers but oh well i am almost there i have one last thing to do and it, that's pretty much like the thing that ties it all together it is the outfit so i'm gonna go put it on currently I have on a sweatshirt and um mickey mouse pj pants i had my mom tailor the pants to my height because the pants um, are built for people with long legs and as a 5'3 human being I know that's not the shortest but it's still not like normal because most pants and most jeans are too long for my legs anyways yeah um yeah this is me as Maddie from Euphoria this is what I bought this outfit for I bought it like fucking February to do this video for Halloween my dog is coughing in the back because he's old as shit. This one was always my favorite line, even before TikTok. This one was just always fucking funny to me. I don't know if your brain is all scrambled from like all the molly you take, but I never said that. If you spread a lie like that again, I'll fucking come for you. We good? That shit made me laugh so hard because I'm like, bitch, you were on molly too. <laughs> I'm just wearing like strappy uh kitten heels black kitten heels she wore like black sneakers i think in the show obviously i'm not even going out like this like i wouldn't even feel comfortable going out like this without like my boyfriend with me because you know men you know i i still don't see the resemblance but i think it's cute <laughs> what in god's name is your problem you cunt okay but it's so cute like now i feel it myself hey <laughs> Come on, bro. I need hoops. She had hoops. Hold up. That picture. She's like, ow, my fucking pinky. Um, okay, well, there's not really much else to say or do. Um, this is it. This is, I'm like admiring how it looks. Like, it looks good. Okay, so yeah, that's pretty much it. That's the Maddie from Euphoria. Halloween costume slash transformation slash like transforming into my lookalike because you guys say I look like her even though I still don't think I do but obviously you can tell what character I'm playing I'm playing fucking Maddie I'm playing Maddie I don't know if your brain is all scrambled from like all the fucking molly you take I gotta go I gotta go I gotta go